Hey guys, it's your boy, Peter John. Welcome to the episode 358 of Logo History. Today I'm going to talk about Z5 Kids, Laura Martella Pictures, Yugu Productions, The Angry Video Game Nerd, Nostalgia Critic, Cackper, and Dead Meat. Z5 Kids was requested by the data everything on my Discord server, Laura Martella Pictures and Yugu Productions were requested by JamRxD on my Discord server, The Angry Video Game Nerd and Nostalgia Critic were requested by Bookster the Dawid Lover 2021 on my Discord server and Cackper and Dead Meat were requested by Mr. Dawidster on my Discord server. Check out their channels by clicking on the cards above. I hope you like it. First, I'm gonna talk about Yubu Productions. It was an independent production company founded in 1982 by television producer Gary David Goldberg. 1982 to 2002, there are the words Yubu and Productions in black text. Here is an intro. Sit, Ubu, sit. Good dog. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Laura Martella Pictures. It was an entertainment company established in April 1986 with the merger of Lorimar Television and Telepictures. 1986 to 1989, there are the words Lorimar and Telepictures in black text except the fonts are different. Here is an intro. Alright, now I'm gonna talk about Dead Meat. It is a horror movie channel celebrating everything great and awful about the genre. 2017 to the present, there are the words dead and meat in red text. Here is an intro. I had left you guys. If I ever find a little basses of business, a dead meat. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Nostalgia Critic. It is an American review comedy web series created, directed by and starring web comedian Doug Walker. 2007 to the present, there are the words nostalgia and critic in black text except the first letter I of the word critic is a silhouette of a man wearing a red tie and holding a gun. Here is an intro. All right, now I'm gonna talk about Z5 Kids. It is the children version of an Indian on-demand internet streaming media provider run by Essel Group via its subsidiary Z Entertainment Enterprises. 2020 to the present, there are five lines, one blue, one green, one yellow, one orange and one pink, and on the right of them there is a black circle, and inside it there is the word Z in white text, and on the right of the circle there is a black number five, and on the right of it there is the word kids in blue, yellow, orange and green text. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Kakber. He is a Polish blogger, known mainly from videos about the older days of YouTube and the Time to Try series. 2018 to 2021, unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 2021 to the present, there is a drawing of a man with black hair wearing glasses. Here is an intro. All right, now I'm gonna talk about the angry video game nerd. It is an American retro gaming review comedy web series created by and starring James Rolfe. 2004 to 2004, here we have the logo of the first The Angry Video Game Nerd's name, Bad Ness Games. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this logo. 2006 to 2006, here we have the logo of the second The Angry Video Game Nerd's name, The Angry Nintendo Nerd. There are two men one playing an instrument and one angry, and on them there are the words the angry Nintendo and nerd in golden text, and under them there are the words 2006 and cinemassacer.com in yellow text. Here is a variant and an intro. He's the angry Nintendo nerd. 2006 to 2007, they changed its name to the angry video game nerd. There is the word screwattack.coms in white text, and under it there are the words angry video game and nerd in red text, and under them there are the words push and start in white text, and on the right of them there is an angry man holding a video game controller, and under the man there are the words 2006 and cinemassacer.com in white text. Here is an intro. He's the angry video game nerd. 2007 to the present, there are the words the and angry in red, and orange gradient text on a black outline, and under them there are the words video and game in yellow text on a black outline, and on the right of them there is the word nerd in white text on a black and red, and orange gradient outline, and on the right of it there is a red attack hit. Here is the Japanese version, a variant and an intro.
Okay guys, this is it for today. I really hope you liked it. Stay tuned for the episode 359 that is going to be about KDFW and KXAS TV. And also don't forget to join my Discord server and to subscribe to my channel so you can watch all my videos. I am Peter John, this is Logo History and until tomorrow, bye.